the wealth sought by the Romans, Dacian fortresses of the Orestia Mountains. This is a statue of Decebalus, king of the Dacian kingdom, which thrived during the first century AD. The Dacians built their stronghold in the Orestia Mountains of Midwest Romania. People worshipped natural deities and built many temples. They believed in the eternity of their souls. These are the remains of their capital, Samitgetsua. The city covered about three hectares and had some 4,000 residents. The fortress surrounding the city was built using some remarkable building techniques. These holes in the fortress walls were used to place timber joints to fix two parallel wall stones. The gaps between the stones were filled with small stones. This helped the structure to absorb shocks from outside and therefore made it less easy to breach. Gold and silver were plentiful in this region and the Dacians had techniques to finally process them. They thrived by trading them with surrounding countries and extended their territory. Dacia covered an area which was much larger than Romania is today. However, their success soon attracted the attention of the Romans. The Romans were continuously expanding their territory and needed funds to maintain it. The Dacian Wars broke out in 101 AD. The relief on this column portrays a scene from this war. It is depicted from the Roman point of view. This is the Roman army. Emperor Trajanus came over with 100,000 soldiers to conquer the Dacians. The Dacian king, Decebalus, was surrounded by Roman soldiers. At the end, he chose to commit suicide rather than become a prisoner of war. The Dacian kingdom fell and their capital was destroyed. The territory became part of a Roman colony and renamed Romania, the country of the Romans.